right? It doesn't look like a hair dryer, but it's just a normal hair dryer. It's just that I removed the, the head part of it. So what you want to do is you want to heat it up, right? You want to heat the back part of your phone up because there's a layer of like uh, double-sided tape. And when you, so when you heat the double-sided tape up in, inside the phone, uh, the glue will loosen and you can remove the back cover easily. So this will take you about like maybe five minutes say. So what you want to do is you heat it up for one minute each time. And remember when you heat it up, heat up the, the sides of the phone, right? Don't heat up the middle part because that's kind of pointless. The tape is at the side of the phone. So just, just, re just heat up the, the sides. Okay, so after you heat it up, what you want to do is you need a suction cup, right? A suction cup and I bought this really cheap at a store it's actually a phone holder right you're supposed to fix it to your windscreen and it holds your phone with this clip but it has a really strong suction cup you can see here you just stick the suction cup to your screen and then you actually press down on this uh, plastic part you can see here so when you press it down it sort of like pulls the suction cup in removes the air so it sticks really well so if you don't have this what you can do is you get um, this like smaller suction cups right? it's gonna be harder so try to get one like huge one you know where you can get this you can get this at, um, at the Tesco or you know those supermarkets and those uh, hardware stores where they have like the toilet uh, what do you call that shelves so some of them have this suction cup so you just get the big really strong suction cup so when you have a big strong suction cup what you do is you put it behind here on your phone the glass back cover right and then you press it down make sure it's stuck to the phone okay so you can see here oops this is not good so it needs to be stuck really tightly right and okay my phone is not doing so well here so you need to make sure that it's stuck really tightly okay now it's stuck there right okay if it doesn't stick well you have to wash it so what i did was earlier i already had uh you know i already did this you can see that it now has a lot of glass pieces so it's not sticking so what you want to do is you want to clean this part so that it's clean right and then uh you continue heating it up you just do it yourself Okay, so I did it before, so it's loose now. But what you're gonna do is you're gonna do that for like a minute each, and then you're gonna put the suction cup in, and then you're gonna pull the back cover like this. You keep pulling it so it has to be strong, right? So you will see like each time you pull, you will get um, a little hole coming up. I don't know if you can see it, but you see that hole, right? That little lid, that little like the, the back cover coming up. Okay. So when you pull it, at first it's going to be like, it will just go back down, right? What you need next is you need a guitar pick, like uh, or a ruler or some like a really hard cut like this. Okay. Uh, what you want to do is you pull it to the point where it leaves a little hole and you can actually hold it with, you hold the suction cup with one hand and then you hold the phone with the other hand. There's a little hole here, you're going to slip this guitar pick in there right okay and then you're gonna push um it a bit so that it gets in you can see here it gets in and then you're gonna slide it because what you're doing is actually cutting the um, double-sided tape you just cut the double-sided tape so uh when it's it's able to slide you're actually cutting off this double slide sided tape off so if you don't have this you can buy um, like a plastic pick online like this this is a specialized tool on eBay you just look for the, those back covers they would come with this right and you're slowly gonna like pull pry it so it's like a pry tool if you really don't have that uh, you can use a screwdriver I don't suggest this because you might break your back glass cover because you just pull it pull the suction cup like this hold it with one hand and then you just push it in between the hole and then you slowly pry it open right 
uh, you're gonna have to do this a few times because you might not get a hold so you need some patience you need to keep using the uh, hair dryer to like uh, heat up the sides right so I suggest what you do is when you heat up the sides heat up like the side of the phone and not the top part of the phone right uh, because you want to open it from the bottom and there's also a lot of like the, the cameras on the top so try not to heat up the top too much just the bottom part right so after you do that okay and you get the uh, pick in between the that little space there you just have to slide it slide it slide it slide it slide it to the corners you see the corners and then when it gets to the corners then it's going to be easier to like pry the phone open and then you're gonna pry it all the way down but don't go too much inside you just need to get to the part where uh, there's the, the tape there so you just slowly remove the tape right so once the tape has come now you are able to pry the entire thing open you, it's gonna take a lot of patience right so I really can't do it if let's say you you don't have any tool sometimes a fingernail might actually help as well so you're gonna pull it and you're gonna pry the entire back open like this. There you go, right? So I actually did this earlier already. That's why it's so easy, but you can see some glue there. See, that's some glue. Uh, you have a look at. So yeah, so the tape is actually, at, as you can see this, the tape is actually just at the corners, right? So once uh, you, so the pry to what it does, Right, or you use your fingernail or whatever you just put it in here right and then it sort of cuts that little it cuts that little uh, tape away so it's all you're doing you're just cutting the tape away so it's not that difficult to do it yourself to remove the back cover you don't need um, you know a heat gun you just need a hair dryer so you just have a hair dryer you blow it and then you're able to take that out and then once you are able to take that out, you have access to changing your uh, removable battery and your USB port. I'm going to do another video on how to remove uh, this USB port part because, you know, there's a damage on my Huawei Mate 10. That port has gone in. So I have no idea why. So I guess it's a quality control problem. Um, so that's what I'm going to do. And... I'll see you guys. I hope this has been helpful. I wish uh, mobile phone companies would make more removable batteries because all they are doing now um, is put this here to get uh, the waterproofing because that little tape there prevents the water from going in. I'm sure that you know if they make like removable battery covers, they can always like include some tape for you to put it there. Like because once you take it out and you take it to the shop anyway, and when they do this, they will have to find uh like the tape again to put it back to get your water resistance back or your waterproofing back. So um one thing I want to mention is that like Samsung phones they are going to be tougher because they have a really high rating for water proofing. So they're gonna they're gonna need a lot of like heating up with your hair dryer. So yeah. That's, I hope it helped you guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.